Well, good evening, YouTube. Um, Lee Doran, better known as How the World Works, has a story in his latest roundup about the EU banning Britain from selling eggs by the half dozen or dozen. Um, there's only one problem with that story. It's nonsense. Um, you see, the... Um, the actual leg proposed legislation says uh, this um, the net quantity of a food shall be expressed using litres, centilitres, millilitres, kilograms or grams as appropriate a in units of liquid in the case of liquids within the, within the meaning of council directive 85339 EEC of 27th of June 1985 on containers of liquids for human consumption or B, in units of mass in the case of other products. Nowhere in that does it say that you can't also sell them in as six eggs or twelve eggs. It just says you have to say what the mass is as well. Okay? Um, now, presumably Lee was going to turn around here and say, well, that's an added cost to, you know, the, ultimately the consumer will have to buy it. Well, not really, because um, EU regulations allow um, for um, understating the size of a product. And you can actually overstate by up to 3% to allow for, you know, errors in manufacturing and so on. So if you were to say that, you know, they were at least however many grams, it wouldn't be a problem. Even less of a problem, seeing as um, at least in the UK, when you buy eggs, they're class A, class B, class C, which is an indication of um, mass. And a class A egg um, has to weigh between 63 and 73 grams anyway. Now, I did tell a little bit of a porky pie there. Um, there wasn't just one problem. With that, there, there were a few problems. Um, the next problem was he took that from the Daily Mail. Um, this is not a newspaper known for its journalistic standards. Um, this is the newspaper that ran a story saying that Steve Jobs was gonna was talking about recalling the iPhone the iPhone four uh, until they realised that it was from the fake Steve Jobs Twitter. Whoops. Which brings me on to the broader point. Um, how is it, I don't know, Lee, if you're watching this, that we can trust what you're saying? Because you haven't done the research into this. You've just repeated something from a newspaper of low journalistic integrity and quality that is generally recognised as such. Um, it just took, you know, literally about 30 seconds Googling to find the actual, um, you know, story. And I'll put links in the, uh, in the, in the footer as well. Um, now, Lee, as I understand it, is opposed to the European Union. Uh, I disagree with him, but it's a perfectly reasonable position to hold. And it might even actually have been reasonable to criticise this proposed uh, directive. Is it a directive or a regulation? Um, well, legislation from the European Parliament. Um, you know, saying, well, actually, they should have made allowance for, for some things which, you know, conventionally are bought in units because, you know, you want, you know that much egg, or, you know, six eggs rather than half a kilo of eggs. That might have been a legitimate criticism, but instead he came up with um, a load of nonsense that doesn't actually have any relationship to the truth. Um, and that's unfortunate, because instead of doing something useful and potentially exposing bad lawmaking, I don't know, um, he, he's just made himself look a bit silly. Anyway, most of um, this comes from uh, John Band on Liberal Conspiracy. Links inside in the doobly-doo. I'm Landon Cole. I'll see you next time.